Hi guys, so how are you doing? Um, this is a Diagnostic World video. Uh, we're going to show you the Maxi Check Hotel Maxi Check Pro. Uh, one of Mercedes Benz here. Um, we're not exactly going to show you um, in great detail because um, we don't have any DPF to actually reset at the moment. Um, but I will show you the tool and basically what it can do. Uh, so we'll go through the uh, sort of the function. We've got uh, the OBD2 function. This will read fault codes in the engine module for uh, any OBD2 vehicle, basically. Um, so this is just a, a quick test in this Mercedes Benz that we're in right now. It's found three codes, three codes which, in fact, we did know that already existed. Um, but it's just a basic check to show the uh, the tool working. All right, so the ABS and SRS systems, so that's the airbag and the ABS systems. I'll click on Benz. So it's an E class that we have right here. It's a two eleven. You can see it's got the ABS warning lights on the dash there, which means it is communicating with the ABS uh, module. All right, so um, adaptive brake, that's the ABS system. All right, so read codes. system pass no codes that's good that is what we were expecting now we'll click into the airbag system see if we can get any fault codes we don't believe there should there would be any we are just checking just for the purposes of the video really just to show you the uh, the tool actually in action and maybe uh, diagnosing these systems system pass no fault codes so that's good that's also what we expected all right, so we'll come out of those. Those are really your main functions. Um, now, also on the uh, the Maxi Check Pro, we have special functions. So we've got DPF, which will um, it'll force a regeneration. It will release, uh, sorry, remove trouble codes for the DPF. It will reset the ECU after fitting a new D DPF. It will also reset the EOLYS. Uh, warning after you've uh, topped up the system. We've got electronic parking brake as well. It will also um, read and diagnose any faults in this system. Let's see if we can just do a quick check here. Fortunately, it does mean that we have to select the vehicle every time. It's not supported at the moment. It'll be one for one of the updates. So we'll just come out of that. So what else have we got? We've got oil service reset. Uh, so when you've done a service, it will uh, reset the computer to tell the system that the uh, reset has been done. Steering angle sensor. That's quite a big one as well. Uh, we do get a lot of requests off customers uh, looking for diagnostics to reset the steering angle sensor. Uh, well, this will do that for you. And then, last but not least, we have the TPMS, which is the throttle position sensor. Uh, no, it's not. What am I talking about? <laughs> it's a tyre pressure monitoring system. You know, once you've had a long day and you've got all of these systems and, and code names running through your head, that's what happens, you start hallucinating. And that's not communicating either. Oh well. The main the main systems here though, we'll be looking at the uh, the engine, the ABS, SRS and the DPF. The DP, DPS is probably uh, the best and main feature on this diagnostic tool because um, 
as with the uh, the, the, TP, uh, sorry, the steering angle, we do get lots of requests uh, from customers who uh, need to reset the DPF or force a regeneration. Uh, lots of vehicles, it has been widely publicised as well that lots of cars uh, are having trouble with the DPF systems. Um, I don't I don't know what it is, the, the, the manufacturers just somehow don't seem to have got it right and it's costing people an arm and a leg in, uh, and I'm not actually surprised as to uh, a lot of people who are actually getting their DPF completely removed from the systems. Um, it is illegal, but I can see why people are doing it because the alternative is to to spend you know like three thousand pounds on a new system, which is just absolutely ludicrous. Um, but this will force a regeneration, um, and it will, as I say, it will also reset the DPF codes, DPF warning light, uh, EOLYS, and uh, ECU as after filling a new DPF as well. Uh, so thanks for watching this video. This uh, MaxiCheck Pro is available just by clicking the link directly below this video uh, or you can visit www.diagnostic-